What's up people of the internet, I'm the big pot here with yet another video. In this video we will be testing the Intel Celeron N2840 which is a CPU based on the silver mode architecture and part of the Bachelor family of power efficient processors. It has two cores with no hyper threading of course and it has a burst frequency of up to 2.58 GHz. The Celeron N2840 has the Intel HD Graphics Bay Trail as the integrated graphics, which have 4 unified shaders and a burst frequency of up to 792 MHz in the Celeron's case. It's also based on the same Ivy Bridge architecture as the Intel HD 4000, weirdly enough. You also have 4GB of RAM in single channel mode, as well as a 500GB hard drive for the operating system and a 1TB external one on which the game that we'll be playing today is installed. As for operating system, we're using normal Windows 10, as mom also uses the PC. You can find a full description of the specs in the video description down below. The game that we'll be benchmarking today is Mortal Kombat Complete Edition from 2011, 2013 on PC. And I'm testing it because in the last video, I tried the sequel on Mortal Kombat XL, which does work, however it has crashing issues, so let's get straight to the point now. One really important note, please listen carefully, that I'm going to add here is, when you're adjusting the game settings, make sure to increase the texture quality to medium. Sounds ridiculous, I know, but this prevents the game from not being able to launch at all when you try to play it again after your first time of playing. Anyway, let's go! Unfortunately, by default, you cannot lower the resolution from 1280 by 720p, or it might be different for some people for some videos that I've seen, I don't know. If you also cannot lower the resolution further from 720p, but you really want more FPS, don't worry, follow me. First, we need to go to the config file of Mortal Kombat 9, which is located in Users, Updater, Roaming, MKKE, the config file is simply called Options, opening it up to lower the resolution is as simple as it looks, it's as self-explanatory as it gets. 
Let's first try out 1024 by 768. Now let's try out the well-known 800 by 600 resolution.
Let's lower the resolution even further, you know, to 640 by 400, which is actually widescreen, so even better. By the way, I'm curious if you can get Mortal Kombat Complete Edition to run at 60fps on the entry rate 40, so you know what? Let's hold that resolution to the lowest that we can go, and oh boy, the game will look more beautiful than what your poor imagination can imagine.